Education Minister Dr. Nian Gadsby Dolly says she is a strong advocate for there to be a compulsory technical and vocational education and training or TVET subject at the secondary school level. A statement came at the launch of YTEP's Institute of Culinary Arts in Shigonas on Wednesday. Suna Lala has more. Here is not simply love of food, it's love of business, love of industry, love of sustainability. Education Minister Dr. Nian Gadsby Dolly hailed YTEP's Institute which she believes will attract many students around the region to make a name for themselves in the culinary arts. She says the industry is full of opportunities and believes this institute could not have come at a better time when many are seeking to sharpen their skills. And if we look at what has been happening and how persons have had to adopt new careers in this pandemic where people have lost their jobs, where the whole scenario has changed, and we look at the fact that those who were able to best survive, some of those were persons who were skilled in some way. The Institute provides specialized hands-on training with advanced programs in the culinary arts from industry professionals at the state-of-the-art facilities, including several training kitchens, and would eventually have a bakery and dining restaurant when fully completed. YTEP's chairman, Tara Best, believes this will be one of the fastest-growing institutes in the region. Our research informed that the hospitality and food service industry is one of the fastest growing industries in this country, requiring competent, experienced, well-trained and qualified professionals. And one of the institution's current trainees already has high hopes in the near future. You will remember the young man who gave this speech and most importantly, you will remember his name. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Daniel Rashid. Sonolala, TTT News.